Rudy Poo Candy Ass. It's out of control at this point. Now, my previous video, I talked about one of the lawyers for Donald Trump. But there's one name in the Donald Trump defense team that pretty much gets more attention than anyone else. And of course, that name is Alina Haba. Now, I don't like the idea of calling her a candy ass because she fits the bill perfectly. I mean, this woman is more interested in being famous, being on television, being on Fox News, Newsmax, Max No One In, rather than defending her client, who is, of course, Donald Trump. And me personally, I couldn't care less. This woman wants to hang Trump, that's fine. But when you, but this is becoming more and more dangerous for Donald Trump. Me personally, and the rest of the country, couldn't get, care less. If Donald Trump wants to hang himself with lawyers like this, they can, she can hang herself. But when you have a lawyer who pretty much tells everyone that, yeah, Donald Trump did, yeah, I know about it, yeah, my attorneys know about it, yeah, a whole lot of people know about it, then it becomes a problem. And not to mention when you crow about it on television, whether it be Fox News or then whatever, then it becomes a very serious problem for your client. Now, now it gets even worse. Not recent, too recently, she went on Newsmax to try and spin, literally spin, the revelations that Donald Trump had uh, documents that which the FBI got their hands on at their raid at Mar-a-Lago, saying, of course, that those documents were the nu were about the nuclear capabilities of an allied nation. This is what she had to say. Incredibly disturbing to me um, in terms of leaks coming from the Justice Department, the fact that you know, we had originally, and let's remember the timeline here, originally there were nuclear codes and the latest and greatest is, you know, there's empty folders and now they're saying there's top secret information about another country. You know, when you have to defend yourself, stories come out when and that's exactly what I believe they are, just stories. Right. So at this point, if you look at the left wing media's storytelling, it's inconsistent, it's outrageous, and it's and, and it's been all over the map. Really? Seriously? That 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 that's where you're going with this, Haba. You're gonna blame you're gonna go pull out that oh they're they're attacking me. I've been caught, so I'm gonna bleed. Blame the media. Seriously? That, that's where you're going with this. You're seriously going to blame the media because your client was caught with top secret document, classified documents he should never not been having. He's no longer the president. Let's get that out there right there before I say go further. Donald Trump is no longer the president. So why does he have classified information at his house? And not to mention the fact you're trying to blame, you're going full circle from Donald Trump didn't do this to, yeah, he did, but it doesn't matter, to, yeah, he did, it doesn't matter, and it's all the media's fault because they're trying to take Donald Trump down, and they're trying to, the Justice Department is trying to do that too. It's all a conspiracy. It's a huge conspiracy. Haba, stop. You're not helping your client. And more to the point, I think, honestly, this woman is trying to just keep herself famous. She's trying to be famous. That's why she does all these interviews with Newsmax and ONN. She's trying to stay famous. She's trying to stay relevant. Rather than doing her job, shutting her mouth in front of the television cameras and focusing on Donald Trump's defense. But instead, she wants to look good for ONN and Fox, the Fox News masters. Frankly, I think the only, me personally, I think the only reason why 
Donald Trump uh, hired this woman is because one, she's a woman, two, she's a beautiful woman, three, she's probably he's probably um, fantasizing about how the banger. I'm I'm willing to bet dollars to donuts that he is in at home watching her on television. Probably the same way Jack Nicholson did at, at one at one scene of The Departed. And I'm not making jokes about that. I so wholeheartedly believe that this clown is going to going to uh, going to go to jail, and she and he has only three people to believe that are blamed for it: himself, his advisors, who probably said you can do whatever you want. Right. I'm, I'm Donald Trump. You're Donald Trump. You're Donald freaking Trump. You can do whatever you want and no one can touch you, which is a lie. And the third person he needs to blame are his attorneys, especially Alina Haba. Alina, you put yourself in this position. You put yourself in the position of being impossibly disbarred, disgraced, and destroyed. But for now, I have the greatest pleasure of telling you that you are nothing more than a Rudy Poo candy ass. CTP, know the truth. God bless. Peace to the left, justice to the right.